Hi, I'm Mika Jong Bikong and study at SJKC Zhonghua Bidulu in Sawa. Today, I want to introduce you a book. And it's called 50 Things You Should Know About World War I. And the author of the book is Jim Eldridge. When I saw this book at the bookshop, I told my mom I wanted it and she bought it for me because uh, because what what caught my attention the most is how the world unfolds. First, they start with swords and horses and, and end up with tanks, planes, and artillery. You can say this is the start of modern warfare. 50 things you should know, you should know about the First World War is divided into 50 sections. Examining key battles like the Battle of Verdun, the Battle of Jutland, and the Battle of Somme, and key events like the Russian Revolution, and key figures like. Here's the key figures of the Allies. It's British, it's France, and it's Russia. Here's the key figure of the Central Power. Sorry if I don't know how to pronounce the name. Hmm. There's Germany, Hungary, 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 also Hungary, and Otto, the Otto Empire. Ottoman um, Empire, which is called Turkey today. And my favorite part of the book is the Battle of Jutland. Because the Battle of Jutland is the only major naval battle during World War I. And if you don't know me, I like naval battle. As you can see here. Mm. Thank you for letting me introduce you this book. To you. Oh yeah, if you also want to know more about World War, I also suggest you to read this. 50 things you should know about the Second World War. Thank you. Bye.